church for free. I have them today. We're going to have a prayer out. If you guys can stand, you know it, repeat with, with us. And we do Ready? I believe my Amy church was growing more. And that I was making a top priority to make it so. Every biblical Christian, every Christian at work, every worker trained, or they need not be ashamed. This we have in Jesus' name. Amen. up this morning. He's worthy to be praised. Hallelujah. Amen and amen. Hallelujah. You may be seated in the house. Amen. Where the praises go up and the blessings come on down. Amen. Amen. You're in the right place today. Amen. Disillusionment, disappointment, by glory to God. We need to come to you, Lord. You're the one. You're the one, glory to God. We say thank you, Lord. We say thank you, Lord. So right now, Lord, we speak healing to sick bodies right now in the name of Jesus. Somebody walked in here right now with pain in their body. Release that pain out of their body right now in the name of Jesus. day to be alive, isn't it? Hallelujah. And to see each other's face. So we want you to know that you are welcome in this place. And so will you stand and walk around and greet someone and let them know, maybe we have guests in the house, and let them know you are welcome. Stand up and greet somebody. Hallelujah. Happy Veterans Day. Brother Lionel Monsanto, the Army. Michael Jermaine Jones, son of Jimmy and Joanne Rogers, the Navy. Drill Sergeant Missilia Acevedo, daughter of Sister Sharon Acevedo. Ramar Harvin, father of Pastor Sapp, the Air Force. Dwight Van Williams, brother of Joanne Rogers, the Army. Curtis Williams, husband of Sister Jeannie Williams, the Navy. Daryl T. White, nephew of Sister Corrine Odoms, the Army. Donald R. Stakes, nephew of Sister Corrine Odoms, the Air Force. Curtis Williams, brother of Sister Joanne Rogers, the Army. GSP Church honors you and we thank you for your service. Ladies and gentlemen, it is my honor to introduce a man and show your love for the second coming of the one and only. Amen. This is Amen. GSP Church News for this week.
so he did not want her to build or lay her eggs in that tree because what would have happened? It would get knocked down and the eggs would what? The eggs would all break. So sometimes that's what happens with us. As far as the mama bird knew, she was having a heck of a time. She was having a storm. All her efforts was going nowhere. Who was God in the story? you to go somewhere else and when you get there you'll find it's better than you could have ever done on your own amen it's contagious y'all it's contagious it's contagious <laughs> y'all come get your babies <laughs> you call the Red Cross, before you look for answers on Facebook, Instagram, or Snapchat, uh, before you Google for relief, before you call in the marriage counselor, before you call Bebe Nim, before you do anything, uh, go to God in prayer and be persistent. Now, I got six kids, and they all claim I got a favorite. I, got this, I just got one that big better. Be persistent. As we exit out, singing our farewell song, greet someone on your way out, amen? 